last night. And I just woke up this morning feeling awful. It was Friday yesterday and I was like, you know what? I worked hard this week. I'm going to celebrate. Now I feel like shit. I don't think I'm going to leave my house today. I feel like recently anytime I stay up past 11 p.m., like nothing good ever happens. I always regret it. I need to just make it a rule moving forward. Like, okay, Emma, you go to bed at 11 and like, you have to stick to it. I cannot name one good thing that's happened to me after 11 p.m. Actually ever. I love my morning routine that I have going. You know, I make my coffee, I maybe meditate a little bit, whatever, but if I go out, all of that gets fucked up. All of that gets fucked up. I wake up late, I don't wanna meditate, I end up skipping out on all of my healthy habits. What is going on? <laughs> What are you guys doing? Moral of the story is like, I refuse to stay up late moving forward. Like no more staying up late for me. I don't wanna do it. I don't care if there's like a fun opportunity. Ow, ow, your paw is in my, ow. I don't care if there's like some sort of fun activity. Like if it's past 11 p.m., I'm not going. I've been reading the same book for like three months and I haven't finished it yet and I kind of feel guilty. Like in the beginning I was burning through it and then now I'm not. It's still a great book but I'm just not like, I'm not. I've been getting into painting in art in general a little bit more recently because it's easy. You can just kind of sit down and start drawing stuff, painting stuff, whatever, and it's like easy, kind of therapeutic. I painted something two days ago that I'm actually proud of. I'm actually proud of it. And I'm so proud of it that I hung it up right there. It kind of makes me want to keep making art. I had a little bit of success. I have a little bit of potential. And now I'm like, okay, wait, maybe this can be my thing. It won't. Maybe I'll make this little space by my bed, my art wall. And I'll put all my favorite paintings and drawings there to remind me to stop going on the internet and to maybe paint instead. the decision that I'm, I'm not gonna leave the house today at all. So I'm gonna try to make the most out of my, my day at home. I try to just like draw from my imagination. Things go really bad. What the fuck? But if I have like something I'm trying to draw, it tends to go a little bit better. So maybe I'll try to draw like something. Maybe I'll try to draw my water cup. 
recently how there's all this pressure to like have a life where you do a lot of shit. Do you know what I mean? Like what's so bad about things being simple? I'm not saying that like, you know, you never do anything crazy. Like you never go on a fun vacation or you never go to a nice dinner. I'm just saying that generally like 80% of the time life is just very mundane and boring. And that's not necessarily awful. It doesn't mean that you're doing something wrong if your life is like that. It doesn't mean that your life sucks. Once I accepted that I enjoy having a more simple life, I actually enjoy it a lot more. a fish in the wine glass. How fucking goofy is that? I kind of regret putting him in there. It's in fact too late now, so I have to make it work. That is my POTD, painting of the day. You know, I said I wasn't gonna leave my house today, but I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I'm gonna be a little bit bummed out if I don't leave the house. I, need, I do need to get out of here. Um, <laughs> vibes are off. I need to get out. I just can't seem to get out of bed today. Like, why do cats do this? When cats do this, it makes me like very uncomfortable. I think it means that he thinks that I'm his mom, which is actually like precious, but it's just kind of like something about it kind of grosses me out. than going on a walk in your neighborhood. Come on, everybody, give it up. In my head, when I imagine going on a walk, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna see cement, I'm going to see like a few trees, I'm gonna see a few houses, and I'm gonna go home, and like, what did, what did we gain from that? But it always ends up being so much nicer than I expect. I walked past this parking garage just now that I wanted to go on top of so badly, but I feel like I would get the police called on me if I did go in it, because it looks very secure, like it, it they had like security guards and stuff of that sort. Oh my God, there's a cat over there. <gasps> the cat is coming toward me. Stop. This could be a... Come here, come here. Like I know I have cats at home, but like I would love to experience a feral random cat right now. Just went into somebody's front yard. I'm extremely, oh, it's coming back. Come here. Look at my little friend. He looks exactly like my cat at home, named Oliver. Also, normally I'd be scared that a random cat on the street would have rabies, but this one has like a very exquisite collar, which tells me that that cat probably doesn't have rabies. Listen, it's possible. The collar may be giving me a false sense of security. That cat could fully have fleas and rabies. It's too late now. What is it about like the clothes that you put on before you go on a walk? Like when I'm about to go on a walk, I put on the weirdest shit. Like why? I have not worn these socks in probably two years. This shirt has holes in the armpit. Okay, like I'm wearing biker shorts. Like what am I wearing? Whoever owns this little gray kitty is pretty ballsy for letting this cat just like roam around Los Angeles where people drive like 400 miles an hour and steal things. Like why would you let your cat roam around? Oh my God, there's a car. 
I don't know what to do. I think I'm just gonna stay here as the car drives by. Hey. I wanna kill. How do you explain this? How the fuck do you explain this? I'm going home now. I spent the whole day in bed and I mean, I feel pretty good about it. Hey, I went on a walk. The fuck? Oh, I painted? Bitch, I did things the day after I spend all day in bed. I am unstoppable because I'm all rested up. Like tomorrow's about to be crazy. Like I'm gonna fucking do some crazy shit. Like I might even go to the grocery store tomorrow. Mm -hmm.